IBC chairman Wafula Chebukati was taken aback by the return of Conin Kadha and Margaret Mochanya four months after their dramatic resignation when they faulted him for mismanaging the electoral body. And Kadha and Mochanya returned to anniversary towers yesterday and spent the day in the IBC vice chairperson's office but did not meet Chebukati, sources close to the chairman, disclosing that he was miffed by their return and failure to report to him as protocol would require. And as soon as Nkada and Mwachanya stepped out later in the evening, Chebukati ordered a change of door locks in their offices, making it impossible for them to access commission headquarters should they return on Monday. That same day, Chebukati is expected to address the issue of their comeback, even as sources disclosed that he was treating them as strangers. The standoff will also be heading to the corridors of justice. Activist Okia Omtata is lining up a petition against the trio's return to office. You cannot walk away from a job, absconded duty for five months, and then purport to come back to, an, to a public office as though, you are, as though it is your private kiosk. The IBC is not a private kiosk of anybody, and once you walk away, you walk away for good. You don't come back. Nkada, Mwachanya, and Paul Kurgat are pegging their return on High Court Judge Wilfrida Okwanyi's ruling that they had not followed the laydown procedure when they resigned on April 16th through a televised news conference. Nkada had in her response to a petition filed by Omtata confirmed through a sworn affidavit that she tendered her resignation to President Uhuru Kenyatta. Her exit, as well as that of her two colleagues, has remained a puzzle since the House was yet to confirm receipt of their resignation letters or declare the slots vacant. Those commissioners lied to the president. Kwamba, we have gone home. Alafu wa Narudi. This should not be allowed to happen. Chebukati had in an earlier affidavit held that the three commissioners have not reported to work since April and had not copied their resignation letters to the commission. This, according to the chairman, amounted to absconding duty and therefore a violation of the commission's human resources guidelines. My plea to Mr. Chebukati not to, to budge and the remaining the other two commissioners, the chairman and the other two commissioners, to stand their ground and make sure that these individual, this Individuals who are now strangers do not access the IBC offices. All eyes will now be on anniversary towers next week as the three returnees face Chebukati. Francis Gashuri, Citizen TV.